welcome back to Stan's Gym Ladies Group. I'm just going to pop a light on as I don't think it's actually my phone is actually doing anything of value. So hopefully you can see me okay. It's a bit, I don't think it's a bit dark. I'm just going to pop a, pop this, this open. That might be a bit better. Who knows? We don't know. Now, I'm not sure if that that's a that's a bit better. Maybe. Right, I'm super excited. Tomorrow is the day when I actually start my diet. Okay. Um it's a bit nerve-wracking, always a bit nerve-wracking when you're gonna go starting on your diet again. So this is what I've bought. I have bought my mushrooms. Give me a thumbs up if you can actually um, see me okay, okay? Because it's my, my, I'm doing it on my phone at the moment and it keeps going a bit light, dark, light, dark, light, dark. I think that's a bit better. Now it's gone dark again. Very strange. Right, um, so I've got my mushrooms. Um, I've got my fruit. Uh, my blackberries that i got strawberries i always like fresh stuff because if i've i found when i was done that smoothie last night and i used the frozen fruit i don't know it's got this horrible twang to it it, it was all in day everything was fine but i always prefer fresh fruit you cannot go wrong with fresh everything fresh so i've got me other packet of strawberries i must have about three or four packets of strawberries in my fridge my fridge is absolutely chocker um i've got me apples as well because don't forget hey good girl samantha well done one day i am going to be down there um my friend is actually she's dragging me down there on on a Monday, that's when I'm being, I'm being dragged down there. Oh dear me! See, PT gone wild. <laughs> that's what I am. <laughs> okay, um, I've got me apples. Uh, I do love doing a fruit salad. Sometimes what I do is I even even if you're doing spaghetti bolognese, do it fresh. Don't just get it out of a tin or don't just go down there and think, hey, look, there's a celery world or a Weight Watcher um, ready meal. Depending on how busy you are, then that's when that they come into, into play. Um, but do the recipe books. Make everything fresh. Make everything um, yourself. That's what the mushrooms are for. Um, weigh your pasta. Please weigh everything. Weigh everything. Um, pasta, I know on, I know I keep buzzing on about Slimming World and buzzing on about, um, Weight Watchers, but I've tried Slimming World, I could only lose, uh, let me see, um, a stone, I think I only lost a stone on there, um, yeah, my body only got to a stone and then it started putting on, putting on and putting on. Because the way my mindset was, I did lose over a little bit of a stone, you know, last time I was on now. But in all fairness, my body does react better with Weight Watchers because I'm pointing everything. Um, you've got literally, on this flex plan, you have literally got 200 free foods. Which I'm going to read, I'm not going to read a whole 200 out, so, you know... I've actually got my computer as well, um, because it's, um, oh dear, what have I just done? I had it, I had it all worked out, and then I just got to press the wrong button. Oh well, never mind. Hey de ho. Um, but, but yeah, so, um, so what do I, what do I do on my diet? So what I like to do is I like to do everything, as I said, fresh. Make everything fresh. Weight Watchers, right, as I was saying about buzzing on about, that's it, buzzing on about um, everything. 
With Slimming World, I did notice that obviously the pasta was free. You could eat as much pasta as you liked. That's what I was told. Um, not by the leader, but by the pe other people that went there. Oh, yeah, you can eat as much rice, as much pasta. Um, no, Nutella like, not rice. As much pasta, as much as many potatoes as you like. Um, so I just used to just pile on the mashed potato, pile on it. And I used to think, this is so alien to me because the very first time I did start the diet, the very first time, was Weight Watchers. So, and to be honest, I only tried Slimming World um, to see what it was like. Everybody was going, oh yeah, you lose so much on Slimming World, this, that and the other. But I'd already started my journey a long, long time ago with Weight Watchers. So I do feel... Um, obligated if that's the right word i do feel that's my home that's where i feel comfy you know i mean the leader i go to and well, we'll be going to on thursday she is apps marsha is absolutely lovely she really is she's there for you it's the same as the simming world in um south ockenden uh vicky she's lovely as well she's there for you um they literally go the whole hog so that you end up getting your results okay and um hang on let me just type it in on my on my computer because I, I want to read all the every single um the foods that we have that are free um are literally it's two there's 200 of them it's mad I don't know how many free foods. So if you're a Weight Watcher, and I'm not a Weight Watcher, look at me, um, a Slimming World girl, um, how many foods, free foods, have have you got? Um, because it'd be interesting to see, you know, because it's like you can have, apart from smoked fish, smoked fish on Weight Watchers is not free. So that's it I, I like my smoked fish i like smoked mackerel i like smoke i'm gonna make your mouth water now aren't i smoked mackerel smoked haddock i'm not too fast on um what is it i'm really i'm not too fast on um cod i'm not a fishy person you know i, I can take it or i can leave it um but on here you have so many you've got different recipes and like you have in in your swimming world book you've also get down to iceland because if you're a swimming world girl then you've got all all different foods that they're doing but please try and do everything fresh i bought these they are weight watchers whole meal wraps and they are just literally three points so you can have one of them what i would normally do is I would normally have one of them chicken because chicken breasts are free with um, Slimming World and uh, Weight Watchers. So what I would normally do is I would put uh, shredded, you know, like um, you know, like the chicken breast strips. I would normally cook some of them up, put some of them in with a bit of salad, and um, and what I'm going to do is I am going to be doing what I do, my food. So you will be seeing how I diet. Um, and when I'm telling you, don't deny yourself anything, okay? Don't deny yourself anything. Point it. You see, oh, yeah, we do have a YouTube channel, which I did post oh, before I came online. Um, on the Stan's Gym ladies group. It's called Stan's Gym ladies and men's group because when I was floating around with the idea of it, some of the men at the gym were going, oh yeah, 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 we could we could um, give you the videos and we could be post, we could get you to post this, that and the other. And I went, yeah, 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 of course. But in all honesty, it was literally my weight loss journey, my struggles, my 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 joys my tears everything you know and the food that i cook so you're actually going to see me cooking what um foods that i actually had i think i did um uh, a salad with um 
When did I actually do it? If it is on there. I think it was a... Um, I love seafood. Absolutely adore seafood. And I know that on the Weight Watchers, and I know, I think, on the Slimming World, it's free. Because I know that is one of them. So I had mussels. I think I had... Um, what else did I have? Mussels, cockles, and other different bits and pieces. Um... And my with, with my salad and my plate was full you could see how much i had my sunday roasts i used to post because um if your slimming world leader has a post or if your weight watcher de um leader has a facebook page and you can even use this use the ladies group as your food diary okay so my diet started whenever um and this is what I have for breakfast. This is what I have for lunch. Put pictures. Start posting pictures. My um my roast dinners, I tell you, literally say that's the plate, yeah, up there, because I bundle it up with chicken. I do not do not no more. And I said this to Stan earlier because he's gone to me. I was talking about food, and he went, "Oh, he says I really like your roast potatoes." I am. This is annoying me now because it's, let me go over here. That's a bit better, I think. Is that better? You can see me now. I can see everybody. Now I've got to hold the super thing. Right. Hey. Okay. Right. So, um, so I, what I did is I don't deny myself stuff. If I fancy um say with because obviously i don't know if the swimming world has an app if they do just just give me a little thumbs up just just do a little heart or whatever you can find on there um just to say yeah we we have an app too use it use the app our app is that we can go around the shop and we can i love it you zap literally your food instead of using a little calculator like you used to do you remember the little calculators if you've ever done weight watches um then um now you've got your app on your phone and you can go around the shop i go around my kitchen and i and my all my stuff i zap everything and it comes up with the points so say like you've got i have pointed um these caramel um things that my kids like and for one of them is six points it's not you not only got to look at the saturated fat but please look at the sugar Look at the sugar content that you've got in them foods and then get a bag of sugar, weigh out exactly how much it says on the back of that packet and you will see just how much sugar is in one bar. One bar. It's disgusting. Um, but they're so nice and they always make these things that really are really nice. Um, the one tea cake uh is five points and then caramel things was six points so it was absolutely you know you sit there and you think to yourself okay what am i going to do point all your food this is what i do before all my before i start my diet i get everything in order so i get all my foods in i mean i've got spring greens over there i've got lettuce um cucumber tomatoes um a master meat as they did not have as much white watcher stuff as what they normally do because normally they have the cheese you can have the white watcher cheese white watcher cheese slices cheese triangles etc 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 but this time they didn't for some random reason i don't know but i got my whole meal wraps which i'm super 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 pleased um i think there was too many supers in there really but but i would do my chicken wrap and i would point say if i wanted a sauce in there i would point how much that sauce is and then obviously that would go down say two points for that so you can have a complete lunch for about four or five points or you can go completely the opposite and have a completely free free lunch you can have you can eat free foods all day long even with what even with slimming world you can eat 
free foods all day long and you and the only things that you'll have to do i think you get uh 15 sins um in slimming world i'm not sure i've not been for ages and um but you can have say like you can have a bag of crisps you can have a, like so long as you sin it or point it don't deny yourself anything um you can even weight watchers have got a recipe that um let me show you because this is what i liked and and it's literally all right you wouldn't eat the whole thing but look chocolate cake and that is eight points you know um another and there's something else as well that that i found last night which was literally only two points so you can have a complete diet of free food and um of free food all day long and then of an evening when the kids are gone to bed or you fancy the nibble you can have you can have that glass of wine you can have that um that chocolate bar as long as you point it if you don't put if you don't if you do not this is what i was saying trying to say yesterday but alexis bless her um was in the middle of it all but this is what i'm saying if if you um write everything down because i think slimming world and weight watchers have trackers okay i don't know what they're called in slimming world but i call them trackers uh, i think they're food diary type things um and if you're on your own little diet that you're just cutting out all the cakes the sweets the crisps or a calorie controlled diet and you're counting your calories then um you can just have a piece of paper and you can just write it down you know like sandwich so many calories but if you're doing the weight watchers or the slimming world then you have to know the points and the sins and then you just write that down but make sure it is essential. It is one big key, and that is to write everything down. Make sure that you are, as I said last night, make sure you're honest with yourself. Because I know that there's been times when I had eaten, when I was on the diet, not when not when I was losing my six stone, but when I was on my diet, probably about oh, a year ago. I think it must have been a year ago that I'd, been to Weight Watchers a year and a half maybe um there's yeah because I think my YouTube channel started around about then so that was a year ago um, when I've actually looked at it and I thought to myself my days I haven't posted in that stage gym um thing like channel for just over a year so um so I've been eating absolute rubbish for a year no wonder I've got so fat <laughs> um but in all honesty i absolutely ate rubbish one time when i went and i thought myself oh, i'm gonna put on and i lost two pounds and i'm thinking whoa i've just ate complete rubbish for a whole week and i've lost two pound either her scales are wrong or something's not right so then I'm like milling around doing my own little thing. The next week I go and in my mind, I've been good. In my mind, I'm sitting there feeling very, you know, I would have lost two pounds. I've only had one naughty week this time where last week when I lost two pounds, you know, and I went there and she said, you put on three pounds. Uh, what? <laughs> How the heck did that happen? And I sat there and I looked at her and I've gone, but I've been good. I've been really, really good. How how did that happen? And then when you actually sit there and you analyse it, you think, last week caught up with me. I got away with, somehow or somewhere, I got away with doing something. Must have been the exercising that i done that, and then all of a sudden now, that one naughty day has cost me three pounds and that's so disheartening and then after that you you go there and she goes yeah you've you've just yeah you've lost a half or or you've put on i think i broke my what done me was i broke my scaphoid bone 
So I had a cast on that. I was hoping that she would calculate the cast and and then work it out from that. But she, but they didn't. So I kept putting on, I kept putting, in the end I thought, what's the point? I've broke my arm, broke my wrist, what is the point? And then from then on, I was in the wrong mindset. I could not focus. And plus I was stress eating as well, because I was going through some stress. And, um, and it was like, I just could not focus. Everything I was doing, it was wrong. Morning, Emma. It was, everything I was doing was, it was just bad, okay? So that's why I'm saying, be in the right mindset, like what I was saying yesterday, in the right, so long as you're in the right, right mindset, you can make this work. I'm super, super, super excited because I'm going to go back to Weight Watchers tomorrow and um, it's going to be quite um, interesting to say because I don't know what I actually weigh. Um... I would think I would, last time I got weighed, I was in the 11s. Now, that's not me, you know. But who knows? Who knows? I could be, um, I, could, I, could, I could surprise myself. See, I'm stuttering now. I could surprise myself and only be, say, yeah, mindset is everything, you know. But, yeah, um... I don't know, I could be nine stone, who knows? But that's, nah, nah. <laughs> that is like getting your mind elsewhere, putting it in there, and then when you get there, you're like, that's not fair. I thought I was going to be this. So if I always think to myself, I, you know, even when I'm there, I normally wear, I normally wear, First day, I cheat, right? First day, I normally go in jeans, get weighed in jeans, and then the next week, I put on something light, and then I stick to whatever I'm weighed in now, because then you end up weighing lighter, which is, that's how my mind works. Probably isn't, not true, but there you go. You get some people that just get weighed in jeans, and to me, jeans weigh heavy. And um, when I lost that six stone, I literally was I think a half away and that trying to get that half off is hard really really hard so what I did was there was girls there that were taking their tops off and there were this and that it was so funny it was just hilarious one woman she had this bracelet on she just took her bracelet off got on the scales and she, and she had was that her goal and we all looked and we're like is that loud don't know yeah it's allowed you know, but make dieting fun, you know, dieting should not be, oh, I've got a diet, oh, I'm this, I'm that, don't deny yourself anything, um, as I said, you've got all your free foods, um, with Weight Watchers, and I don't know about Slimming World, I know, I can only do, I can only say what I know with Weight Watchers, and a little bit of what I know with Slimming World, so correct me, please correct me if I am wrong, um, but with Weight Watchers and Slimming World, all your fruit is free. Um, all your vegetables is is free. Um, you with uh, your dookie beans are free. Avocados are not because they're points because they are fattening anyway. But they are very very good for your skin. Very good. And um, also, I know somebody else that's got very good skin products so if you want skin products right go to emma louise that's on this that's on here right she does body shop stuff and at the moment she's very very tempting me on different products so go with her as well <laughs> um but yeah so if i if i bring it back over to what i've actually i'm going to set back up here because i think you find the the light yes the light no the lighting's not changed over here right so i've bought my my spring greens a little bit sorry for themselves but i don't know quite why but they're today's my spring greens um i've got my my lettuces and me onions this is all free you, this is not free that as i just showed you that is the whole meal wraps weight watchers and they're only three points um 
and me mushrooms. Um, head over to, as I said, head over to the Stan's Gym Ladies and Men's Group um, YouTube channel because we've got our own, well, I've got my own thing. That was then, but a year ago was when I was doing it all. And on there, I do a complete barbecue um, and I show you how to have a barbecue, how you can still enjoy stuff, but have like, um, I don't know, you can have like, uh, what are they call there's skewers with like your, your vegetables, like your tomatoes, your peppers, uh, mushrooms, sweet corn, um, what else? And then, and then you've got your fruit salads. I mean, I absolutely love it. When I'm on a diet, and if I've got my mindset, I call it the groove. When you're in the diet in groove, you go a long way. You really do. But as soon as you get out of that groove, that's it. You go down, down, and down. And um, and that's how I that's what happened to me. I went down and down, but now I'm in the right mindset. I want to lose my weight. I want to get back into the stuff that I was able to get into. Uh, I've got some beautiful trousers that I can just look at. It won't even go past my knee, you know. It'll go up to my kneecap. But if you try and squeeze your little self, it will big self, into that pair of jeans, no, it won't, won't work. <laughs> and then you get really upset, then you get down, then you get fed up, and then you get depressed, and then you want to shout at everybody. And then they, they all go, what's the matter with her? What's the matter with mum? Nothing, leave me alone. You know, and it and it's not fair on anybody, you know, but I do know, which is why I gave up my PT work. I loved my PT work. I really, really did. But in all honesty, I would look at myself in the mirror and I would think, PTs are not meant to be fat. They're meant to be an example of what you can achieve. You know, and here's me wiggling down the corridor with my little love handles and, you know. <laughs> Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Julie, the fat personal trainer. You know, this is, I can have a laugh about it because it's like, it's me. You know, but to my customers that are standing there before me, crying their eyes out because they want to lose weight they don't know how to lose weight and they need my help i know what they're going through i know what what is going on with them i know because i'm there myself i'm not some little skinny bird anymore that can just go a good example right i'm not going to name the gym i really ain't because i'm not naming and shaming or anything but I had just had Alexis and I was in, um, what was I in? I was in Tesco's and I was pushing her in the pram. So I still had my baby belly. And there was a personal trainer from another local gym to us. And um, she was with another PT, a bloke PT. And um, all of a sudden she's like, look me up and down and kissed her teeth and looked at me in disgust as if to say oh look at that walking by oh that is just disgusting and that really upset me and i just looked at her and i thought i hope oh, this is gonna be really naughty now and i looked at her and this is no word of a lie but i thought i hope you get fat when you get a baby <laughs> And I shouldn't have thought that, but I thought to myself, you have no idea. I've got five children. You know, I nearly lost my life on the last one. And um, and I just looked at her and I thought, I'm just thankful to be alive at the moment because I came out of hospital after having sepsis, um, going in there after losing two stone, straight away after having my baby, getting back into my size 12s, and then getting into hospital after having sepsis, Coming out, size, I don't know what. I think it was a size 16. And I'm like, what have they done to me? So, and for her to look at me like that, that damaged me. Really, really damaged me. But I forgive her. I've moved on since then. 
and um, I'm going to do something about it, finally do something. I mean, regular training, and that is why I said I could not do my PT, and, and Stan was going, oh, you got you a customer. I'm like, no, no. I'm not taking any more people on. So he says, well, why? I said, until I lose my weight, then I will. But he's going, but they know what you're going through. They, you know what they're going through. So I'm like, yeah, I know. But it's, for me, the image. Of, I have got that woman in my head. So after having her in my head, looking at me the way she did, I'm thinking... It's not a good image. I want to be able to lose weight so that I'm an example, you know. But what I get, what I do is I do work my girls hard and they look amazing afterwards. And I did have one, one lady, unfortunately, did make a little sarcastic comment, you know, but I'm not going to go into that. But at the end, and I think that was another reason why I said no, I'm not doing it anymore but i will i will give you little tips little hints little little golden nuggets on training and obviously i'm doing the dieting as well so you will be seeing me cooking food cooking what i'm doing and um literally you you will be my this will be my weight loss journey so I'm hoping, because sometimes you can get stuck in a rut and think, I don't know what to have for dinner. I don't know what to have for breakfast. And then someone comes along and goes, this is what I'm having. And you think, oh, that looks nice. I didn't even think you could have that when you was on a diet. That's why I say, don't deny yourself anything. You have literally 200 free foods on Weight Watchers and probably X amount. You might even have the same amount on Slimming World. You got all your salads, you got all your fruit, you got all your vegetables, you got all your chicken. Um do something. Have even if you have a break not a breakfast, um a lunch that is literally three points. You know, and if all you've done is got right, I've had a whole lunch, I'm really full up, because staying fuller for longer is the key as well. Okay, eating foods that's gonna fill you up for longer. And also, don't forget to, to drink your water. The more water you drink, as I said, you will lose the fat on the inside first. So the more water that you drink, it helps for you to lose weight. And um, also, um, there was a, something else I was going to say, and it's gone now. It's just fizzled out my head. Um, but, but yeah... So I'm going to be doing all that with all my food, so you're going to see exactly what. And there are little, little other little things as well, like banana pancakes. Bananas are free, uh, and you just mash a couple of bananas up. I think it might even be one egg, um, and then obviously you do a your little pancake thing. Mine don't turn out right. They really don't. Other people's they turn out okay. Mine. They're just like a mess on the plate, but hey ho, I know that, that that's a free food. <laughs> so then you can put your fruit. I used to love literally having at the end of the day, I used to save some of some of my points when I used to do the like the old school way, the old um the old when it was before Weight Watchers went over to the flex plan and it was um I think you had eighty I think I had eighteen points at one point. Um, I used to literally save some of my points up for the evening and I used to have a bowl, I used to have a massive great big bowl of um, fruit salad with one Weight Watcher yogurt which was I think a toffee one and I think that was only one point So, and I used to just pour that all the way over it and I used to thoroughly thoroughly enjoy it kids used to go out we used to have mcdonald's i used to have small fries used to be able to work it all out you can still have mcdonald's so long as you point it and so long as you sin it that's why i'm saying do not deny yourself anything as soon as you deny yourself something that is when you go wrong that is when all of a sudden you start fancying stuff and you're thinking they're eating that i'm not i want that you know, carry a book, you know, a shopping guide or something. I mean, I'm okay because I've got the app now. 
um so i can just look up what mcdonald's um fries are and what mcdonald's and something else um or choose a healthier option choose a healthier option always go healthier try not to don't try not to have too many mcdonald's otherwise then mcdonald's will catch up with you trust me um but choose replace something naughty with something healthy okay so you can you can have anything you want right so i'm gonna i'm gonna disappear i'm going to do my lunch and i am going to tell you how much i weigh tomorrow oh dear right guys catch you tomorrow love you bye